I'm coming live because I'm so excited about today. Today for myself marks the start. I started in October with um, getting back on my journey and then knew that by the time I got to this point, I would be at my starting point. So I'm at my starting point of where I was and I get to and then I just drop. Anybody else like that where you just get to these places and then be like, hey, now is the time. I'm not doing it like this no more. That's where I'm at. And me, myself, just to introduce, um, I know you've been watching me down my wall and you see me always talking about specific products. Hey, Omega! You see me talking about products. You see me talking about weight loss. You see me talking about working out. And maybe a lot of you all don't know me or you have not seen me and you don't understand this big journey. But me, myself, I'm a woman that used to weigh 275 pounds. I was a size 22, 24 and uh, pre-diabetic, real frustrated. Three, I have three teenagers. Um, I'm a wife. I'm an entrepreneur of 20 years. And I just felt like I couldn't get this one thing off me, which is like I was being successful in all these other areas, but I just could not drop this dang on weight. And it was causing me a lot of stress, frustration, and depression. And then even too, in those places, um, when you are stressed, frustrated, and depressed, guess what else happens? You stress eat. And I, man, was stress eating so much. I remember when I got, I remember when I toppled over into the twos and I was trying to protect my brain going, um, it's okay, it's just 200. Right. And then I remember when I went to 215 and it was like, it's OK, just go buy another size. You could be comfortable. And then I remember when I got to 250 and then looked on up and I was 275. And I just remember those time frames being very, very frustrating for me. And also too, just trying to get it off. I tried for 10 years to get it off. I put myself in the hospital. If you saw me, I was on um, Biggest Loser on the finale of Biggest Loser when I talked about I was putting myself in the hospital often of just being so in a place where I just wanted it off. I wanted it off my frame and my body. And then I realized what I was doing was I was doing it incorrectly. My level of uh, just needing it now um, was trying to go buy. Anybody went to go buy those pills thinking, you buy these pills, you're going to be small. And I was buying synthetic things that sped my heart rate up so fast that um, to God be the glory that nothing happened to me, um, that I was able to come back and do it again. And when you go through things sometimes that hard, it puts you in a space where um, you get personally connected. So I, in being in this business, name of my company is Be Well by Tracy Matree. Um, by being in this company, um, I have a unique way of working with people just because I have a heart for it. I, I remember the day in which I was rolling down, trying to tie my shoes and needed to inhale first. I remember walking past my reflection and seeing my stomach big or my extra roll and just not feeling confident um, or wanting to talk on the phone and not necessarily see a person right in the front because I didn't like the mirror image in which I was seeing, how frustrating that was or even feeling like I wasn't a success I was at a height of my career celebrity stylist out here doing with everything but staying behind the screen because I didn't like what I saw and it was one area that I just felt like I could not master and I was just so frustrated and I was really on the outside everybody seeing this strong woman she's nice or whatever but in the inside I was really really crumbling because I could not do I couldn't do the one thing that I really desired which was take care of myself a little bit better and so that's why it's been so personal to me in this journey for myself is because I get it. When I talk to people over the phone or I'm making recommendations for products or you know what, I don't suggest you do this, I suggest you do this. It's really coming from a place of understanding. So what I did was is I went and I became an AFAA instructor. Um, I also became a certified life coach. I'm one of those. Like, if we're going to do it, we're going to do it. So I became an AFAA instructor, a certified life coach, and almost like so close to being a nutritionist. It was like, why don't you just go take the test, girl? And it was really because I was paying trainers 
I was paying other people who were never in my situation and really had a difficult time identifying with me, identifying with my struggle and was doing things like, and it wasn't to their, they weren't horrible. Like that's what they do, right? We definitely do not want to down that profession because even my husband's a personal trainer. Absolutely not. But I remember sitting there trying to do a sit up and the trainer gave me five pounds and told me to sit up. And I'm sitting up going at 275. I, I God, that's enough. 280 is just hard. And so I walked through that process of a year and a half of taking that off of my body by myself and learned a heck of a lot, got a lot of certifications. And then, you know, now I'm so happy to be home um, with helping other people to do the same thing in which I'm doing. So if this video has touched you and you're like, I want you to be my coach. I really want to start losing weight and I want you to help me too because I want to tell you some things in which I'm doing and I want you to help me and adjust and I'm at that place now too. I really want to take this off my body. Then send me some information. You can go to www.coachtracymadrid.com. You can look through, um, I have a lot. I'm also a personal development business coach. So I have um, seminars in which I work with people on the psychology of actually how it is to lose weight and what it does to you. Um, I can help you put together a plan of action for yourself. Even too, if you're someone who's saying, okay, now that I got this together, I actually wanna get into the gym, I can make recommendations for you too and actually get you to that plan. So I like to see myself as a bit more of a comprehensive um, weight loss solution for you. So if you think you do, I would love to hear from you. If you're watching this video, respond to the video. You can inbox me if you see this on any form of social media. You can also too follow me in my YouTube channel, which is coachtracymadrid.com. So I can't wait to work with you. Um, thank you so much for taking the time out to listen to my story and I cannot wait to help you create your own.